Hey folks, Nitno here. The goal of this video is to give you a good understanding of each scope in Vanilla DayZ. Make sure to use the timeline feature down below to easily skip around the video by sight. If you do find this video helpful, please make sure to subscribe. Quickly, before we start, I want to make sure you understand how to zero your weapon. To put it simply, zeroing compensates for bullet drop and adjusts the range that your scope will be accurate to. On PC, you can zero with page up and page down, and on console, with your weapon raised, use the D-pad up or down. Starting off, we have the mini sights, compatible with the M-Lock, FX-45, CR-75, Deagle, and the BK-133 shotgun. The mini sight is a one-time sight and only takes one slot of inventory space. The red dot is powered by a 9 volt battery and the sight can be repaired with an electronic repair kit. Next up, the handgun scope can only be attached to the Deagle. It is magnified by 1.8 times and takes up a 3 by one slot in your inventory. The scope does not require any power and it cannot be repaired. Don't sleep on this weapon combo, it can land some devastating shots and drop players at a distance. The PU scope is one of my favorite scopes. It can be attached to the Mosin and the SK. It features a magnification of 3.5 times and takes up a 3x1 inventory slot. This scope does not require power and it cannot be repaired. When ranging for the PU scope, as a general rule, if an enemy player's shoulders fit in the space in the horizontal lines, they are about 100 meters. If the player's shoulders fit about one half of that space, it is about 200 meters. Another half of that space, and we're looking at about 300 meters. The hunting scope features a variable zoom function, allowing you to scope between four times and 12 times magnification. This scope takes up four slots in your inventory, it does not require a battery, and it cannot be repaired. This scope is my go-to for long range sniping, and in my opinion, is the best in the game. The Cobra Sight is a one-time scope that takes up four slots of inventory space. It must be powered with a 9 volt battery in order to get the crosshair to display. It can be repaired with an electronic repair kit. The PSO-1 scope features a magnification of four times, making it another good choice for long range engagements. This scope takes up six slots of inventory space. Although it can be used without a battery, if a battery is equipped, it will allow you to illuminate the scope. You can also repair the scope with an electronic repair kit. The PSO-1 allows for toggling between the scope and the iron sights. The PSO-1 features a built-in rangefinder if the target fits between the crosshair and the vertical line, they are about 100 meters. Using the rangefinder on the left, fit the target inside to determine their distance. Fitting the target inside the 4 will mean the target is 400 meters away. Zero your weapon for 400 meters and your shot should land on target. The PSO-1-1 follows a similar concept and also has a 4 times magnification, takes up 6 slots, can be powered on by a 9 volt battery, and can be repaired with an electronic repair kit. The built-in rangefinder looks different than the PSO-1, but it works similarly. Fit the target inside the 1 for 100 meters, halfway for 150 meters, in 2 for 200 meters. Set your zeroing for the corresponding distance and your shot should be accurate. The P187-L scope is a 2.8 times scope. This scope takes up two slots, does not require a battery, and cannot be repaired. This scope is currently locked at 200 meters when zoomed in. Using page up and down does not work. In order to accurately hit your target at 100 meters, Aim for the lower chest. 
to hit a target at 200 meters, you can aim directly with your crosshairs. To aim for a 300 meter target, use the second chevron. The 1PN51 scope is a night vision scope with a 3.5 times magnification. The scope takes up a whopping 12 slots of inventory space. The scope requires a 9 volt battery to function and cannot be repaired with an electronic repair kit. One method to range distance is if a standing player is from the crosshair to the top of the first line. They are about 100 meters. If the player fits between the two lines, they're about 200 meters. If a player is about the height of the bottom line, they are 300 meters. The backup iron sights are exclusively for the M4A1 and cannot currently be repaired. The only benefit this really adds is some greater visibility when comparing it to the standard carrying handle sights. The Baraka Reflex Sight is a one-time sight with no magnification. It takes up two slots in your inventory and is powered by a 9 volt battery in order to display the red dot. This sight can be repaired with an electronic repair kit. This is your standard red dot, which is great for close range encounters. The RVN Sight is another one-time sight with no magnification. It takes up two inventory slots, requires a 9 volt battery, and can be repaired with an electronic repair kit. You'll notice the RVN mounts a little bit closer to your eyes than the Baraka Reflex Sight. The Combat Sight is our last one-time scope with no magnification. It takes up two inventory slots, requires a 9 volt battery, and can be repaired with an electronic repair kit. This site offers a nice wide field of view and has an easily visible red dot. Last but not least, the ATOG scope comes in at a 4 times magnification. It takes up two inventory slots, does not require a battery, and cannot be repaired. You can use your target's shoulders to range find. For example, if the shoulders fit within the crosshair, it will be 100 meters. If the shoulders fit in the second horizontal line, it is 200 meters. If they fit in the third line, it will be 300 meters. You can either zero your weapon and use the default crosshair, or if you're 0 to 100 meters, you can directly shoot with the appropriate secondary crosshair. If you found this video helpful in any way, please consider subscribing to the channel and dropping a like. As always, have fun in Daisy. Take it easy. Peace.